Hey everybody, how's it going? This is me, Pikachris here, and welcome to a brand new episode of Pikachris Versus. Today's game is going to be Metal Suck Advanced for the Game Boy Advanced. <clears throat> so yeah, we're pretty much going back to what I've done before. <coughs> Come on! Let me skip the stupid logos. So yeah, Metal Slug. I should be totally familiar with this. Considering that I, the last game that I played in the series was Metal Slug 3. <sighs> because if ever, in case none of you watched my Pick a Quiz vs. episodes on the Metal Slug games 1 through 3, then, then just go check them out. They do kind of suck, but of all of them, 3 is practically my best I've done, because apparently I wasn't going, eh, eh, eh. Well, you, you, you get the idea. You get the idea. Um, yeah. So, uh, yeah, it's been quite a while since I played this game. These games. <coughs> so, yeah. Um, I think I might be in for a little surprise. I don't know. It's Metal Slug. Who am I kidding? It shouldn't be anything to Wait a minute. No Marco Rossi? No Marco or... Or Tarma or anything? Oh, wow. Okay. Well, that's pretty disappointing. We don't have any of the... Not the familiar faces from the other Metal Slug series. I must say, this music is extremely loud as hell. All right, let's cut the shit and let's get on with this. Wait, huh? Did I just see a map? Thank you. Thank you. So the prisoners are not the bearded guys. Okay. What the hell are you reminding me that I got some objects? Oh, There's a civilian up there. Thank you. Gotcha. All right. Apparently, there are no points to be obtained in this. Ow! What the hell? Jesus Christ! These guys are like spamming me. Come on, motherfucker, die! Huh? The hell? Tyra? Wait a minute. What the hell? Are the enemies respawning or something? I really do kind of have to say, the color palette in this game is actually much more brighter in contrast to the previous Metal Slug games I've had, especially Metal Slug 7 slash Double X. Yeah. I better not die here. Because in the world of Metal Slug, if you die, you have to. Oh. Oh, what? The shotgun is the most awesome weapon ever because it sends people flying when they when it shoots something. But at least it's thankfully effective against vehicles, so that shouldn't be much of a problem for me.
All right. Gosh. I'm pretty thankful that we still get this vehicle. And it's pretty damn effective. I don't ever remember if, the, if this vehicle was actually this overpowered in the game. What? Huh? How come I'm not dying? So many secrets okay. to galore for. That shit. Yeah. Can I pop this open? Man, that sucks. I didn't see that coming. Now you shit! Oh, hell, man, that was close. That would have sucked if I died. Oh, <laughs> oh fuck! What's up with this face? Like he's all just like, <laughs> just like that. Just wow. But yeah, that is seriously surprising. I didn't actually die in this thing. Sometimes I'm always supposed to be really good at these kind of games in terms of like completing the first stage in the game. I mean if you've seen my Metal Slug what replay through then Then you wanna then you don't then you'll automatically just see that I am only good at playing through the first stage without dying at least once. And believe me on this or not, I have actually been able to to play through the second stage of the first Metal Slug without dying once. Okay. Do I have health or something? Yeah, here! Jesus Christ. There's so much shit going on. Whoa. L1 armor. Ah! God damn it. What the hell? Are the enemies seriously respawning? What's this? Marco? Huh. Maybe if I beat the game, I'll unlock him. Come here, buddy. Okay, rocket launcher. That's that's okay. That's okay. This is getting extremely annoying with so much gunfire happening. Ah! Okay. 
I hope there's more vehicles than this in the game. I mean, the variation of character vehicles in the first three games, that was absolutely the best part. What's down here? What the hell am I doing here? What the hell do I do here? Huh. Nah, that's probably nothing. What? Are you freaking kidding me? The tank disappeared! Ah, uh, That sucks. At least the fire bombs are pretty effective, so that's good. I'm always in need for a weapon that is effective against anything, especially vehicles. Yep, fucking damn it. That, oh, ah! Those crazy Arabians from Metal Slug 3. Ah! Shit! I didn't realize I had a health bar. Yeah, I stupid helicopter. Thank you. I am really gonna get my ass handed to me at this point. <sighs> okay. Well, we can get through this. I know I can. Right, shoot up this motherfucker. How come it's the gun turret of this thing that's the weak? I mean, wouldn't it have made a lot much more sense if, you know, one of the tanks, one of the, uh, I don't know what that would be called, fuel tank, but. And I just deliberately wasted so much ammo on that one boss. On that one. Eh. Oh boy. Oh boy. Nice. Get over here! Jesus Christ! Oh, wow. This thing keeps moving so much. Come on. Oh, man, that was close! Huh. Yeah! That's right, you motherfucker. Smile. Smile like you're a fucking retard. I'm really saving a lot of prisoners. This is amazing. So from what I assume, if I die from losing all my health, I lose all my prisoners. Oh, and this game has a world map too? Oh wow. Mission three, start. Well that's pretty creative. None of the other Metal Slugs actually had a world map, so I don't see why this one shouldn't. Okay. What? 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 Fuck! That motherfucking bastard. 
Alright, I guess I know what we gotta do. The Mayan bird people. And some soundtrack from Metal Slug, uh... and E, I suppose? Yeah, 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 that's what I remember. I've been playing some Metal Slug off the camera most of the time. So there's no reason as to why I don't remember. There's no reason as to why I shouldn't remember any of those soundtracks specifically. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. I really gotta say, the colors in this game kind of look a little washed out. And the sprite animations... Uh, they don't look too bad for a GBA game. They could be a little better, in my opinion. What? Shit! Huh. Oh man, that was close. Well, that was a close one. The HM ship. Seriously, what are these cards supposed to be like? Are they supposed to be just collectibles or something? Because if that's the case, then I don't even understand why I'm collecting them. Hey, get the hell out of here, you stupid bat! Oh my god. Ah! Probably should not have shot that up. Huh? Thank you. Tarma! Fuck. <sighs> Alright. You know what? No more fucking around. I'm just gonna go through the level. Fuck this. Don't bother saving the civilians. Just go ahead and push through everything. Fuck up all their shit. That's exactly the basis of the game. It's ow. What the? Oh, what the fuck, you asshole! Jesus Christ! Get out of my way! HM ship. I really do not understand where these cards even come from. I mean, what exactly is the point of them? The fuck? Okay. Wow. Seriously. This is getting pretty annoying. This will probably take a while. <sighs> oh yes, it sure is gonna be fun. Ah! What? It's an onslaught of bats. Ow! What the hell, you assholes! Thank you. What? Ah! Yeah, uh. Yum! I gotta get that turkey! Alright. Aha! Nice try. Hit! Ah! Oh man, I thought I was gonna fall down. Oh, so these Nazi guys are in blue now. Get the 
hell out of here. Stupid swimmers laugh. Okay. Grenade onslaught. Sorry I'm yelling so loudly. Nutsack! Wow! Just wow. Okay. Yeah. yeah, you ass and I butt brains ain't getting me this time. I'm just gonna stay on over here and spam my fire. It's me! Just being a total puss! Just sitting here, auto-firing away at everything that comes in out of the water. Yeah. Oh, now there's guys in yellow! Okay. Huh. That's nice. Now in red? Ouch. Alright. Let's move on. Oh, what the hell? Whoa! Ah, uh. oh, you won't go down easy, eh? I fought Metal Slug bosses tougher than you! Oh, oh shit. Are you kidding me? You get to cheat like that, but I can't do anything about it? I really wish there was a way to destroy all those cannons. But yeah, that was actually kind of tough. Yeah. Let's move on, shall we? Yeah. Okay. God damn it. Seriously, I'm kinda disappointed that the shotgun in this game will send people flying and kill them at the same time. That's what's so awesome about this game. How about these games? Of course, right now, I'm being a little nifty. Which, to be fair, is kinda true. But still, it kinda disappoints me that the shotgun doesn't send people flying. What also disappoints me is that Unlike the other Metal Slug titles in the game series, this is one of these games that has no blood spurt for every enemy you shoot or kill. 
Ah! Damn it! No, I jumped there! What the hell? Don't rest room just yeah, just so I can save up some ammo. There we go. I must say, the soundtrack for this stage is pretty fucking awesome. Probably the best in the entire game. Ouch! Fuck! Ah. Oh, come on! Oh! Wow! Man, that was close. The EC chip. Ah! Whoa! Oh, okay. That was a tremendous kill. Alright! Oh wow. What? So the enemies in this game do respawn! What the hell is... Like, what the hell? That is probably the most annoying thing that I've ever seen. In the original Metal Slug games, you don't see that happen, ever. I hate it when enemies constantly respawn so much. It just kind of pisses me off. Ah! Jesus Christ! I see anti-vehicle missile launchers. These guys are actually kind of smart in this game. I must say, this is this is extremely surprising. Normally, these soldiers are actually unequipped. Are equipped with very inferior weapons compared to. But in this game, they're actually pretty fucking smart. What the hell? Where, where am I going? Oh my goodness, I am going to lose the tank. I'm literally going to lose the tank. I don't even know where to go. What the hell is the kind of stage is this? This is a pretty huge problem for me, considering that the enemies themselves respawn. And there I go, I'm dead again! <sighs> okay, this is honestly kind of bullshit. I'm gonna be right back. Hopefully I can complete this stage. If I can't, then... Fuck it. At least I tried. Well, finally I managed to navigate my way... ...out of that one area I was stuck on. I seriously thought this level was non-linear. Army knife. Huh. What? What? Are you kidding me? I can't take that with me? Oh, wow. Things are going ballistic on me. Ah! Whoa! Jesus Christ! So, what do I do? Nah. Suck it! 
Sorry I'm pretty void of speaking, it's just that I'm trying to concentrate as much as possible. Oh wow. Whoa! Okay. This is nuts. Absolutely nuts. This is so problematic because I don't have grenades! Oh boy. Whoa, where's the elevator? Well, shit. Well, I give up. I'm kind of burned out a little bit. So, yeah. Sorry I uh, won't be able to continue on. But, yeah. Overall, I'm pretty glad I came back to this series. It's been a long time since Metal Slug 3. Hopefully someday I'll be I'll be playing another game in this series. <clears throat> so yeah, that's that's that. So I uh, hope you enjoyed and if you did, like and favorite this video and subscribe to my channel for more Pick a Chris verses. And just so you know, I'm on spring break for college as of now, so for all this week, I'm going to be able to make some Pika Chris vs. episodes up until uh, possibly Saturday or Sunday. In the meantime, I'll do my best to try and make sure to get some episodes up and running every day. I'll try and find a game to play, whether it be on Super Nintendo, Genesis or whatever, or possibly on the internet. More like Flash games to say the least. So, thank you all for watching, and I will... Hopefully see you next episode. Till next time, Deacon Chris signing out.